was tonight an opportunity missed? Um, I think tonight's performance was um, wasn't too bad, but um, we should have done more. I think we missed the cutting edge. Um, we should have created even bigger chances from the chances we created. Um, been a bit more patient, maybe. Um, yeah, and uh, again, with some chances, we, were, we weren't lucky enough. But um, yeah, Sheffield, Sheffield worked uh, worked hard as a team, and um, they made it difficult for us. Talk about Sheffield United. Did you see things in Sheffield United tonight that will be the difference between taking Brentford up to, to the levels that they're at? No, no, I think, I think we still played our game and uh, we stuck to our principles. It's just maybe in, um, in a few areas we should have, uh, our decision making should have been better. Um, but yeah, we have our own identity and we should just focus on ourselves. Um, but you saw that Sheffield is um, so maybe a real contender for, for going up. Um, but... I think it's it's on us that we didn't win this game. It has nothing to do with Sheffield, so yeah, we have to fix it um, against West Brom. Going going in at half time down, but with a man advantage. What was what was the message? What was what was been said in the dressing room at that stage? No, the message was was clear. Just do what we uh, what we planned to come here to do. Um, keep moving the ball quick and. I think even before they got the red card, we were in control. Um, the goal happened, but still um, we stuck to the game plan. They got a red card and then, yeah, we were just unfortunate. I think our decision making let us down, but it's something we can, uh, we can fix and it's not the first time that this has happened. So um, we really need to look into it. And having another game in, in three days gives you such a quick opportunity to, to fix it. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, it's good to, to have another game in a short space of time. Um, but every game is important. Um, like you said, this game was important. But we, we have West Brom now. And uh, I think there, uh, there's still a lot of teams we can upset. I just feel t today, we, uh, tonight we let, we let ourselves down. Um, but it's nothing we can't fix, I think. And for, for yourself, you know, you've a bit hit, hit some real good form in recent weeks. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm happy to, um, um, to contribute to the team. Um, so uh, it's good for me to be on the pitch again and uh, playing and playing with confidence. Uh, I understand what the coach needs and I understand what we're trying to do as a club. So. Um, yeah, it feels good just to um, yeah influence uh, the game like I'm doing. And away from away from Brentford, a, a chance next week with your with your nation to to do something big with them as well. Yeah, yeah, we need um, we need a draw or win uh, to go through to the African Nations Cup in the summer. So I'm looking forward to that um, very important game against Libya. Obviously, Henrik had such a great time at a major finals last year with the World Cup. It would mean a lot to you, I presume, to, to do exactly the same thing. Yeah, it would be my first time um, if we do qualify um, for the Nations Cup. It would be my first time at a major tournament. So, um, yeah, we're going, um, we're going all out. Um, yeah, for me, it would be great to be at such a big tournament and, uh, yeah, just change the perception a bit about uh, Bafana Bafana.